Hey guys. Probably a good thing you ain't right here with me because I just got done bush hogging and all that. Hey, I, <laughs> I need to take a shot. But, yeah, it's like playing with, trying to make my little stoves. I, I like it. But yeah, I'll show you why I cut it to the width of the can and then I just swirled it in there in pieces and tucked it just as tight as I could. And it's actually shrunk just a little bit so it don't fall out still but you can see it's getting because as it burns a little bit you know it'll shrink so i probably actually eventually need to take me another one and sandwich it in the outside edge with it but anyway i'm gonna show you why i did it and i practiced it i did the other and i put it in flat i put like two pieces in there flat ways for one like I say they'll fall out uh, if you don't get them in there real tight but they uh they don't hold the, the alcohol as good. And I'm gonna put I'm gonna start off with one ounce. And we'll pour that right in here. Just let it soak it up. That's one ounce of alcohol. I don't know if you can see that. See it ain't leaking. And you can put this on there and leave it for days like that, and it won't leak. Uh, I think two ounces is about, I mean, it might not even be, it might be an ounce and a half. So I, I got another ounce here, but I'm going to pour just a little more and see. Once you start seeing it get where it stays like really, really saturated, which I just did half an ounce right there. not leaking and it'll stay there too I'm gonna pour the rest of it that's two ounces two ounces is probably yeah two ounces is too much that's I can't even uh, I should have probably stopped <laughs> but uh, give me just a second be right back all right I had to go get my piece of tile that's what I burn on just cause you get that on there. Yeah. But that's with two ounces. Yeah, let's see if I can find my lighter. And it's full. Like I can see it. I would show you. It's gonna, it'll spill. See, that's. But, like I say, an ounce and a half. You can cook them, rain manures or anything with one ounce of fuel. So an ounce and a half, if you're in like windy conditions or something. But not worry about it spilling. I've got other ones, and that's the, the premise behind it was if I hit it or knock it over, then I'll lose my alcohol. With this one, you don't. Let me go kill that light. <laughs> makes a pretty flame and I just take that little triangle just put it right there I don't have a windshield out here I should have got it but when you put that around there I mean it just lights right up over the thing what a pretty flame and it's hot too that blue flame we'll do some cooking one ounce on that with no wind will burn probably about five to six minutes. So you can imagine what two ounces is going to do. But if uh, another reason I like this is because I don't have to uh, burn all my fuel like on that one stove. Watch this. I can take this to lid. Well, yeah, still quite a bit of alcohol. Let's do it this way. There you go. <laughs> That's a little better. Pyro. Pyro. Freaking. Anyway, let that sucker cool down. Put the lid on it. As long as you burn enough, I ain't going to touch it. I believe it or not, it's actually not even that hot. But see, I burnt out. It's still going to leak just a little. But I'll go right back to it. 
if you're in camp and you just like put the lid on it and screw it down and sit it up right, you ain't gonna really leak, leak any. Uh, evaporation and uh, heat might, you know, expel a little bit of it, but not much. Most I usually put in it though, or leave in it to carry, it's about an ounce. It works just fine. I put it in uh, a Ziploc bag along with the uh, fuel bottle that I got sitting right here next to it ready to catch on fire. But yeah, that's it. I figured I'd just show a little video on why I did it the way I did it. And that's, it fills it up, the felt don't fall out. And once you got a little bit of fuel, once you've burned enough to make your meal and you still got some left, you can just put the lid on it and it won't uh, leak out. So that's it, man. Have fun making them. I enjoy it. <laughs> I know that. Yeah. I'm kind of a pyromaniac too, though. But that's it. Man.